There is there's some breaking news. The CPM has claimed that one of the party workers, Sheikh Kamrul, has been killed by TMC oh, workers. Oh, this, this incident took place in East uh, Badwan. CPM alleges that five other party workers have been hospitalized. So two things we must point out here that perhaps uh, the violence in Bengal has gotten worse also. We've had an entire conversation about Bengal without mentioning the left at all. So yes. that's perhaps also indicative of where the left is the at this point, or the Congress is at this point. Um, Mr. Sen, is this now? Is this is now worrying? This is worrying. This yes. is yes. serious. If, if, this if is serious. someone is killed, uh, yes, yeah. this is then yes. Until this, uh, there was just a scuffle going on. Yes, there was just. Yeah, this is. Uh, have they uh, have they asked for um, uh, the election commission? Hasn't yet said anything about it. No, 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 this is just they a tweet. This is all we have so far. The tweet that's tweet. on your screen. This is all the information that we have. Uh, CPIM worker has been killed in an attack by TMC. This is an allegation, Each obviously, yes. uh, by the party. Five other comrades have been hospitalized. It says uh, General Secretary demands immediate arrest of all involved and it read salute to the fallen comrades. So the the, the only question note that I wanted to give here is that except for maybe three seats, mm. the, the left is not really in the game in this election at all. That's right. So if this kind of violence will, I mean, it may look. The word party worker is a very omnibusly used loose mm -hmm. term. Anybody can be a party worker. Yes. It could be something personal as well between two people. We don't know. It does acquire the shape every time uh, elections are happening. So we don't know the specifics. But the fact is that. Uh, the, the TMC has moved on in their targets. Now they're going for the BJP fellows. They're not. I mean, no, I don't think they're targeting left. Yeah, so, hmm. they're mean, not even there. Two, I mean, yes, except one or two places where there's. Which, which actually brings us to the conversation. Before we move uh, to one last uh, question of, on Kashmir. What happened to the left? I mean, you actually at this point just said that the left is not even significant enough to be attacked in in uh, you know in Bengal, and given where it. Where it used to be, that is really a step. You know, it, it's really a wash down for uh, for for, yes. for the left. What yes. happened to the left? Well, I think to begin with the I mean, go, to look deeply into it, the left has become a, a victim of its own policy mm. uh, pol policies to begin with, in the sense that it did successfully uh, uh, bring yes. about land reforms. And it did uh, free up a lot of the peasantry and the landless labor from, mm. you know, from the poverty cycles. Now, having reason above that, the, the rural areas slowly started looking for other options, options other than the left. Mm. Add to that was the left was extremely, I mean, the left was behaving there in Bengal somewhat like what the TMC is accused of behaving. Yes. In fact, in fact, the people who are doing what they're doing in West Bengal were originally many of them from the left. Yes, it just shifted so they loyalties, just shifted but not loyalties, behavior. Yes. yes. And so that was one. The other was Mamta fought an extremely long battle, if you remember, on Singur, which yes. really, really then caught the natural the national imagination. Mm. And she claimed to have fought, and perhaps correctly, so that she was fighting on behalf of the peasantry who'd lost their land. Yes, and, and so and this yeah, that's got the visual on the screen of the um, the individual who has lost his life. The CPM claims to have been a party worker, and they accuse the TMC workers of yeah. that murder. On yes. the question of left that you asked me, I also think that one of the reasons why the left has declined badly is that they, they I think failed uh, across the country. It's not just here, yes. even in Tripura or Kerala, mm -hmm. for instance. I think they failed to realize that the aspirational class has changed in India. There is yes. a there's a different need that people have. Mm. There was a time, I mean, it's very fascinating in India, the if first 25, 30 years of Indian elections was pretty much people being so grateful they were independent. But if, and Bollywood reflects that. If you see the movies of 70s and 80s, were all about trade union movements, all about against the Maliks, the angry young India. If you see the India now, and if film is a really indication of it, it's really about narratives. Every film works or doesn't work because of narratives, and which yes. is how it is in politics too. I think it, it films mirror how it works in politics. That angry period coincided with the left's rise. That phase has ended, yes. and they haven't kept pace with it, and that's why you see it doesn't appeal with people anymore. Yes, and, and here I would like to say, yes, uh, what he says is right, absolutely right. Uh, the CPM, or the left, did not change its narrative. Mm. The concept of uh, revolution, concept of petty bourgeoisies, they remain the same and they, they are good only in the textbook. Then. Yes. Because by that time the world had changed. Not only India, yes. but all over. The yes. West had changed, the yes. East had changed, and uh, CPM refused to accept, refused to look at this, and therefore they started receding. So now okay, CPM, if at all, is uh, worth taking care of uh, reckoning with only in Kerala. So, hmm. I just had one anecdote to add yeah. and I want to I actually want to see Shikha's reaction to this. For me, the turning point came on a day 
when I saw and heard for the first time a Starbucks opening in Calcutta mm -hmm. next to the coffee house with a queue that had 200 people in it. The ramification of that, 200 yes. people outside Starbucks. Uh, you One would have assumed about 10-15 years ago, people would have purposely lined up outside coffee house to prove a point. Yes, <laughs> yes. Now, before that, before that in, in Beijing, I had seen McDonald's. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yes. But China was ready to change, but not the uh, uh, right. leftists in uh, Bengal. That was the problem. They lost in the, on the time. Yeah. They lost out on the time. And of course, you know, the advent of television and yeah. internet in India has flattened the world. So everybody knows what a good life looks yeah. like yeah. Yeah. and what a good life needs to feel like. Yeah. So you can no longer convince an Indian in far flung West Bengal or in Uttar Pradesh that it your is life best. is adequate. Yeah. Because I know what I'm missing now, that access is available yeah. to me.